everybody, and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2, where we are returning to Chaos Theory. Oh my god, it's been a pain in the butt. So, I want to first apologize that there hasn't been much Evolution 2 content, like Chaos Theory, for example. And that's because, well, I've been really busy and stuff, and I kind of lost track of, like, everything. So, I want to apologize for, you know forgetting about all this and stuff. And, as you can see here, I didn't finish Jurassic Park. I'm gonna do that on my own time, because, honestly, I already tried recording that video, and I spent two hours just trying to get a T-Rex synthesized, and I got really annoyed, so... You know, I decided, we're gonna start San Diego, and what we're gonna do is, because I wanna start doing other series other than this, is we're just going to be doing one episode for each. So even if we don't finish something like Jurassic Park, Jurassic World, for the long ones, if I don't finish them, that'll be on my own time. But for you are going to at least get one episode, and we'll do as much as we can in the time we have. Rebuild what was once meant to be Jurassic Park San Diego, originally abandoned by John Hammond for his grander vision of Jurassic Park. You should also put Isla Nublar because, you know, it's the same thing. InGen are back with plans for a park set to entertain the masses. This is a bad idea, but let's go for it. Oh yeah, start. Everyone was so caught up in the moment. So impressed with what they'd accomplished. And then... Chaos. A few years later, the dinosaurs made their presence known again at an island called Site B. Here was where InGen had cloned most of the dinosaurs that would eventually be transported to Jurassic Park. It was supposed to be secret. If not for human curiosity, it might have remained one. Peter Ludlow was now in charge of InGen, tasked with bringing his uncle's vision to life. John Hammond had wanted his precious animals to belong to the world. John sent a team to document the dinosaurs. What we found, to our amazement, was how quickly the dinosaurs had adapted. They had made the island their own. Ludlow had the investors. He had secured a location, but he still needed dinosaurs. And now he knew where to get them. What if chaos yielded a different outcome? What if Ludlow's mission was successful and Jurassic Park San Diego had become... Okay, I couldn't hear the last bit that he said, but, you know, we are going to start it. Oh, nope. Okay, so yeah. Nothing in Jurassic World is natural. We have always filled gaps. This isn't Jurassic World. Get the right quote in, Jesus. Come on. Well, sav salvage the failed experiment on Isla Nublar and open a successful park closer to the home in San Diego. This is a bad idea because... Honestly, dinosaurs on the mainland, well, we know what's going to happen when that happens, because, you know, Dominion's coming out in six months. Oh. That is quite, um... Ah, good old Jeff. So, Shut up, us. West Coast of America. By InGen? Oh, years. After the, the incident at our first site, we listened to the concerns, Doctor. And, and ignored them. Part San Diego was put on hold. Hold. Right. But not cancelled. Uh, Mr. Mr. Thompson. I believe in the work. You know? That's why I'm here. <laughs> yeah. There it is. Here because I believe that I can advise you on how to avoid mistakes made previously. Understood. Now, I know I can realize the original vision for this park. I admire your confidence. I've seen it before. Oh, burn! That, that's a smooth one. Okay, listen to the mission briefing, and can I even do anything? Welcome nope. To San Diego, Dr. Malcolm. Oh, it's Lily again. I'm in charge of operations, and I must say it's absolutely fantastic that you're here. Oh, do flatter me more. I wasn't sure you'd say yes. Well, Mr. Thompson doesn't understand chaos or alimony payments. Oh, wait. You know, he'll, uh, he'll learn. 
I was hoping I could pause the game so, you know, I wouldn't be losing money, but nope, they tricked me. So there's San Diego. I thought this was, like, in the city and stuff. Ooh. Oh, there's Jeff. You know, just, you know, getting at everybody. Okay, so... Nope. Construct a response facility. We will do that in this area. Okay, response facility. So, is this, like, their new facility? Like, hold on, let's pause. Okay, so this is basically the visitor center, but, you know... Updated or like more modernized, which honestly, why, why didn't they go with the San Diego? Like, the not the San Diego, the um, what's it called? The engine worker village, like you know, the building that is there in the Lost World. Why not go for that? That would be that'd be sweet, in my opinion. Oh well, let's speed up time, and then we're gonna need to. Can we get power already? Nope, we just can only use a backup generator. Okay, so we'll need to research that as soon as possible. Alright. Oh. Uh, well, yeah, yeah, I think so. Well, unless you want to leave them, of course. We can do that. Okay, so... So, I've seen this part of the thing before, like, many times, because, like, it was shown, like months early and stuff before the game would come out. Oh, we got... Uh, you know, it, it's really cool, like, I really do like the what-ifs, but I've heard, like, I haven't seen Jurassic Park 3 or Fallen Kingdom, like, because those were the ones I was, like, most excited and worried about. Like, I've heard some negatives from, especially the Jurassic Park 3 one, but Fallen Kingdom has actually been rather quiet, and I haven't wanted to gotten it spoiled for me. Viewing gallery, and oh my god, we are just losing the money. It's going red and red, and you know, we'll just send you to do it. Okay, add task. I once heard someone say that determination is power, and I like that. But let's flip it around. Together, we are determined to power everything. Hold on. Actual power. How does that sound? That that works for me. Let's um first research it. Oh, we we need s more scientists probably. Okay, so we can do this. So so that we'll put one right, maybe in front right here. Does it get all three? Okay, it doesn't get that one. So we'll need one more here to reach. We'll put it more back here, that way it can reach anything behind. Let's go around this way. This goes there. And then, you know, path can not connect. Yes, I know, I know, good sir, I know. And then... Ooh! Well, those birds sound lovely, I must say. And then we can get rid of those backup generators, and we should be fully powered. And now we can get rid of this. Okay, Pachycephalosaurus are arriving. Exciting day. Hold on, pause, mister. I'm just gonna build them their enclosure, which we'll use this one first because it's already... Okay, we'll just... Apparently when I order him to fix the fences, he wants to just fix some of them, which is just useless. That should be good. Let's go. This is starting with a herbivore. We want to make sure it's well cared for, obviously, so we'll be monitoring its welfare. <laughs> Hope for the best, plan for the worst. And make sure you can find the nearest exit. <laughs> I, I, I just love... Oh! Okay, transport dinosaurs. We will put them all right over here. And then, what's next? Oh yeah, make sure they are comfortable, which... Right, we'll need the, uh... Uh, what's it called? 
forgot what it was called. The um, the little post thingy. This. Okay, so right here, and then a little good old gate. Right. Ooh, we can fit there. And then we will assign our good old range. Oh, they're already comfortable. How are they doing? How are my boys doing? Wait, what? Compies? Ooh. Safety precautions are in place, Dr. Malcolm. What? They have to be with the latest deliveries. We have a small carnival arriving. And a big one. A larger carnivores too, which are not any kind of cute, if you ask me. What are you talking about? Knowing your history with a particular species, Mr. Thompson thought it best not to trouble you with the details. Oh, yeah, no, I've seen what a T-Rex can do. Uh, my, my therapist and I talk about it all the time. It's a, it's an alpha predator, and now you're bringing it here. Uh, give me two more minutes. I'm not done this one. Wait, why am I? No, you don't. Yes, and uh, here's the thing, Thompson. I know what you're doing as well. Oh God, he is just stone cold. I love it. All right. Well, actually, yeah, we'll just. Okay, so we're gonna have to re-edit our plan. Uh, give me two more minutes again because, well. Now give me two more minutes. How many T-Rexes are there? Alright, so. All around it. Da, 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 da. Oh, yeah. It's right there, so. Never mind. We'll just go straight here. And then, yeah, basically, this will be the biggest attraction. And anything we want to feed to the T-Rexes. Okay, we can transport these guys. Um. We'll, yeah, we'll put them in here. All right, so hold on, pause, and then let's get some water, and then we'll need a viewing vent somewhere. All right, so there, that's water. Then we'll need probably a little bit of forest, not too much. Oh, wait, where's forest? Oh, I guess there's no forest or something. Well, we'll fancy it up a little bit. And then we'll just need a attraction. Which, please tell me you can fit here. No, you can't. Of course you can't, because it's built incorrectly. So we'll just put you correctly right here. Nope, right there. And then we will use our lovely, lovely fences. There. And then... Lovely, lovely fences here, and then we'll go path, and then, of course, we shall do the substation. No, we need a substation, and we'll put it right there, and then we'll just go all the way to this one right. Oh, come on, you could have reached... Nope. Oh, well, I missed by a mile. Unbelievable. Oh my god, this park is already OCD to the max level. Alright, hurry up and build those fences. And also, put a fence. And then, uh, give me two more minutes on those guys. Oh, crap. Oh, thank god. And in cl closure, we'll put this here. And then... You'll need some meat, my dear compy. And then we'll put a ranger team to check you guys. And then we'll delete that. And then we just need some... We'll put a feeder in here for now, like a meat feeder. I know they need live prey, so... We'll go and research that, and while that's researching, we'll then get them. Ugh, God, this is a mess already. All right, so let's go. A goat. All right, he can do it. I don't care how long it takes. Just do that. Let's get some water. We'll need some water. Okay, fine. We'll put you in there. Can't break out from there, I think. Okay, you go there. Okay, pause that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, well, first of all, 
we need to get this enclosure ready for the T-Rexes, which we're going to go crazy and give them the biggest watering spot ever. And then we will... Oh, they got new shrub. Okay, so then we'll change it to that. A bit of tall ones here. And then probably right around here. That should be fine. And let's see the madness. Let's take a look at the bull and female reps. Hold on, let's... Hold on. Oh yeah, look at that beast. He looks awesome. And how does she look? Oh, just... Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay, so... If you guys don't remember, in the original game, we didn't get the female Rex officially, but the JP3 version was basically, um, we'll just basically call it the, um, female Rex. Because, like, everybody, including yours truly, used it for that sole purpose. Now, we just need to make sure that they're at 90% comfort. Let's check. Ooh, they need s What's up? They need sand, okay, my dears. And I think the T-Rex needs sand as well. I could be wrong on that. Okay. Compy's good. Where's a Jeep com Is a Jeep coming? They'll probably need... S I think they need... Oh, wait. No, I think we can get a goat. Okay. Goat will be on the outside. And then... Oh, you're gonna give me a roar? Do it. Do it, mister. Oh, I love the T-Rex's roars. And I'm glad they brought some of the movie ones back for the game. Oh, the goats run. Why are you? He's like, run! Run! Maybe there's freedom out here. There's no freedom. You've cornered yourself, and the female just stalks towards you. Oh, I really want to see the kill animation for a goat on that guy. Alright, I'm pretty sure T-Rex needs a bit of sand, so we'll add some around here. You know, beach it up for him. So, just go around here. Uh, he, he, he's kind of... That, that's a stare down of this. Oh, right, oh, he's going for you. Oh, 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 there goes the door. D did you see how he's doing? Is he okay? Let's see. He's missing prey. And he does need sand. Okay, so we need more s Okay, we need more sand. So we'll just add another goat feeder, you picky bugger. And then... And then, we just need... Uh, where's the jeep? Oh, but he he's crawling away. He's like, I am out of here. Okay. Open the park. This wouldn't have happened without you, Dr. Malcolm. Hey, there we go. Record, uh, I'm not in favor of this park's existence. But this was John Hammond's dream. Who cares? It's a bad idea. Not denied. Okay, so can we fit? Okay, so we can barely fit. Okay. Dr. Malcolm, this facility brings needed stability to InGen's operations. That's a win for us both. No, it's not. The park is a oh yeah, I forgot. Oh, damn it! Or, uh, you know, for the hungry dinosaurs. Oh wait, what? Park, That's not. Please tell me we're not done. I haven't seen this in a long. Right. A living illusion. Oh, he just cuts deep again. He he's he's just going for it. So that was like the whole portion that like I remember seeing before the game came out. So. Okay, increase guest comfort. Let's do this. All right, so guess what do you want? We'll give you a small amenity. And then you'll need this. Dinosaurs? Dinosaurs. Okay, good. And then we'll need a hotel. And they want to. That's why you need to increase our dinosaur visibility. Give our guests a view their eyes won't believe. But visibility's already at 
Okay, so... Okay, let's speed it up, and then we'll just need... A substation probably right here. Like, you know, right in the middle. And how are we doing? We are not making a pro- Oh, we're making 18! Oh, wait, we're starting to make a profit. We're making the money. Which, now, let's see. Where else needs, like, stuff badly? So, like... All over here? All over here, I see. And then probably over here for that? Yes. What about here? Yep. Okay, so we basically need it over here. And before we make this enclosure for probably whatever's coming here, <coughs> excuse me, we will make some guest uh, attractions. Like we'll put one here, and then we'll put one as long as we can fit it here one oh I saw blue and it'll be that one yeah yeah no power I know and then a restaurant in the middle here followed by the pierce of resistance a toilet right over here guest shelter coverage is low which we will put that will go probably right here is fine. There we go. And so now we need a power station right over here to read these guys. And then followed by the cables. Oh, tour rides are available, which we will get that to go through once I build the other enclosures, like these ones, because I'm going to have them run through... Probably around this part. Probably, like, a tour ride just going around here. I probably won't have them going in, because I don't want to risk them getting destroyed. And then you go here. And then straight down the middle. And that should be good. What do we need? Okay, so we just need to increase the profits. We need more money. You've got to have money. Well, stop being so greedy, people, and just give me your cash. Give me it all. Okay, so where do we want it? Do we want it here, or... Eh, screw it. We're going right in the middle. We're going insane. I mean, it's madness, Austin. It's madness. Okay, whoa, whoa, where did our profits go? We just dropped to wait. Okay, why are we dropping? Why are we dropping? What about over here? Oh, okay, so that's in the red. That's in the red. That one's barely making a cent. Okay, that's kind of concerning. Question mark. And also... So we'll just put it there. And we need to go all the way. Okay, so why are we not making any profit? That makes no sense. I am a little confused. Oh, there we go. We're starting to make a bigger profit. Okay, we're at... Okay, so it must have glitched or something. Or, you know, something was going on. Okay, so we'll need that. And can we research the hatchery, actually? That's a good question, because then we can make our own dinosaurs, too. Starting with... Nope, that is not it. It should be in here... Okay, so yes we can. Good, good. So we'll need you, and you can do it on your own, and we need an expedition map. So, let's um make that guest facility. Nope. Where is it? You need to be made. Have at least four scientists employed. Alright, fine, let's hire someone else. Then we'll fire them. Okay, let's see who's ready to be recruited and help me out. 
Someone who's good but not too expensive. What about you? You are a welfare specialist. No. 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 Cheaper incubation will go for you because you're cheap and you got plenty of stuff. Let's go hatchery. Let's do this. Oh wait, that he's already, they're already working on that. We need... Oh, that's already unlocked. Okay, so then... Okay, so you go not over there. You go over here. And we'll need to build a pathway. Right... Wait, oh, oh, that's just the jeep. Okay, so path there. There we go. And then we'll just build the path all the way around. And then all of our facilities can be built here, over here. And we should be able to make the hatchery now, I think. Yes, we can. And we'll see. Do we have any... Please tell me we at least have one dinosaur that we can make straight away. And that we don't need to research, like, if it's Velociraptor, I'll take it. Like, I won't make too many of them, but, you know, I want to just at least get something. Wait. Oh, oh, that's real good. I, I wasn't asking. Okay, let's see. What do we got in here? What's in the hatchery? Nothing. Of course there is. Let's go and dig something up, then. Let's see, what do we got? Okay, that's probably... That's Pachyrhinosaurus, I don't care. Parasaurolophus will go f for, let's see, Triceratops, Triceratops, Struthi, Dilophosaurus, Para, anything down there? Nope. And let me guess, this is Velociraptor, Velociraptor, Parasaurolophus. Okay, we're gonna go with Parasaurolophus first because it is a probably, it's probably the, our best option at the moment. Okay, so we'll go for you. And why why did our prophets just die again? Somebody tell me what's going on. Okay, what what why are we going up and down? Okay, so we need oh we need one over here apparently. And also, do we have t wait do we have um the tour ride actually? Because if we do, nope, that's not it. Okay, we'll research these guys because I know these are really... Oh, staff is too busy. Okay, fine. We'll, we'll pause on that, all right? But I'll build the next enclosure, which this one can be... Um, uh, what's it? Paras. This one can be Struthies, or Struthies could go in with them, maybe. I, I probably don't want raptors to be on the main area here. We'll probably build them, like... Over, I know we need to wait for Momenchi, so actually Momenchi's going to have this space to it. So Raptor's probably going to have to wait, or we're going to have to take away a lot of space from these guys. Hatchery upgrades, yeah, yeah, whatever. So, what's going, oh, uh, yep. They're, they're, they're having a little tussle with it again. God damn, oh, god, god damn, those T-Rexes just really hate them. I mean... I'd be fine with them destroying it, except it costs me money to fix. And they... Th do you think I have all this money just for, you know, spending on you guys? Oh, yes, I do. And... Oh, for gosh sakes, and something's ill. Seriously? Good God, we're not off to a great start, it seems. Alright. Turn this way. And yeah, this one's the smaller one, so... We'll go for Struthies in here. What's up with you? Oh, yeah. We need a paleo medical facility. I did forget about that. So let's go you, paleo medical. Oh, the music is really nice in this. Like, I don't have it turned up too high because, like, last time I had it up to, like, where it was before, it was, like, really loud, and one of my commenters said that it was too loud at certain points and they couldn't hear me, so I had to turn it down and, whoa, let's see, that, whoa, wow, that vehicle, that skin is great, I want it. 
Well, I got it already. Okay, so let's go to the fossils. What do we got? Oh, wait. Before we research, let's get the tour vehicle, Austin. All right, where is it? It should be... I think here? Nope. Uh, here? No. Here? No. Where is it? No, no. I think it's... Last chance. Aha, nailed it, of course. Of course it was here. I knew it was here. No, you didn't. All right. Now let's go... Can we re... Okay, so we... Ugh, damn it, we need three. And we didn't even get that much. Seriously? We needed like 110%. And also, we kind of need to get a new Jeep. So, also, the... F All right, let's replace him with $50,000. And how are we doing on the profits? We are still low, and this is where it starts to get really slow, because, like, the first parts are, like, easy. You just place the dinosaurs, and they get comfortable on their own. Now it's where it's the waiting game, which I don't really like for. Which, also, guys, we're probably going to have to stop at the paras, which is unfortunate, which... I, I know I said at the beginning that, like, I'll probably not do these other parts, but I want you to leave in the comments. Like, next video will be Jurassic Park 3, but do you want me to continue these until they're done, or do you want me to do those on my off time? Because I will do, like, one episode of each, and then, like, for the re whatever I don't finish, I'll do it on my own time. Because if you want me to do that, and like go on to like sandbox theories, because like, I wanted to do tip videos and all that. How is guest coverage low? We've got one here. Oh, it's only covering 29%. Well, quit being so picky, guys. Just move your legs. All you have to worry about over here is some little chickens which can poison you, and some T-Rexes which- Ooh, ooh there's the animation. Ah, I missed it. I really like that animation. I always love watching. Okay, they have taken up a lot of space. I, I just heard something. There's no storm coming, is there? Well, there is puffy clouds coming over in that direction. So, like, wasn't San... I know, like, it should be over there, like, where the bridge is, actually. Like, I know that there was a bridge separating them, but it wasn't this far out. I do remember that. I, I don't know. Maybe I'm just insane, guys. I, I'm probably going crazy. But we'll stay sane for a little longer. And we'll go you. And yep, the music's getting loud again. <clears throat> Alright, how are we doing? Is everything good over here? We're doing good? Okay, good. Because I think it's time we added the main attraction... Which, we could have it, yeah, we'll have it start in the Struthies. Nope, we need to. Okay. Oh, so you can have, oh, that is awesome. So, we're gonna have it like, oh, uh, if this was Isla Nublar, it'd be much better. But, we're just gonna have that. Oh, that looks, that's cool. So you can have it separate now. Like, that was one thing I really didn't like about the first game. Because I, like, saw that there was a mod that, like, you could literally, um, have it that it's separate. S separate? Awesome. Speak English. Separate. But then when I tried doing it, it never worked. And I realized it was because of, it was a mod. Okay, so you guys go there. Please tell me you can go there. Okay, guys, so just a little montage later, or like, you know, just a cut, and I have built the Jurassic Park tour, which will start in the Struthiomimus, go through the Paras, and then go around the San Diego building and stuff, nothing too crazy. Then it's going to go around the T-Rex and go partially through, which I'm going to probably, like, you know, probably off-camera, like, do rocks around here so to, to protect them because I don't think they will bother the Rexes as long as like the Rexes don't for some reason decide you know a goat's over here I'm gonna kill it but hopefully not and how is the paras coming okay they should be almost done but we are going to start work on the Struthiomimus and then we'll rest that guy which can we actually rest him actually 
No, we can't. We need the staff center. My bad. Which, uh, of course it needs to be researched. And para is viable. Thank goodness. All right, so we just need someone, like any of these guys. Okay, so you. Very well. And now let's make a group of Parasaurolophus. They'll be thirsty, but it's fine. It's fine. And you'll be annoyed. Well, guess what? I don't care. You know why? Because you're getting paid, so quit whining. Jeez. All right, now we'll need some more water for the Struthies. And then probably after we get this done, I'm going to end this video. So leave in the comments if you want me to continue to do this in the future or stuff. Or do you want me to just, like, you know, not do it? If I, if you want me to, leave a, leave a yes. If you don't, leave a no. All right? So, yeah. Th well, there it is. And how's the paras coming? Oh, they are good. Let's see. We only have three. Well, that's not fantastic, but uh, we'll make do. Wait, what? We had rabies? Oh, it was the t Oh my god, it was the t Oh my god. I completely forgot about the, the t Hold on, hold on. Where's the negativity? Explain. Okay, we need something over here. Fine. We will do a guest strip right here, which will cover your basic needs, which will start with this. Then we will continue on with this. And then finally, we'll do the grocery, the shopping, and then probably a toilet too. Yep, this whole place is like red rage. And then we'll probably add a hotel later. But I think the Paris... Yeah, yeah, you're disgruntled. Guess what? I don't care. Because you know why? Because I pay you. So picky, these people. You know, I, I pay them they to work here. And you know what? They get disgruntled. Good God. All right, so I think that should... All right, release via airlift. And we will put them down, and I'll make some more off-camera and stuff, and we'll check them out, you know, see how they're doing, and then we are going to end this video, unfortunately. I know, I don't like it either, but you know what? We have to, and whoa, 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 why is everything so in the ri- What the hell's going on? Okay, we are- Going broke. Dinosaur threat, where? Parasaurolof. Oh, sh- Okay, crisis, I think, is adverted, but you are lonely, which three is probably not enough, is it? Yeah, three's not gonna be enough. And you need ground nuts, so... Uh, where's that? Okay, so the paras are a little unhappy, unfortunately. They won't break out, I think. Oh, there is a nice animation. But we are going to wrap it on that, unfortunately. In the next video, guys, will of course be Jurassic Park 3, and then Jurassic World, then Fallen Kingdom. And if you guys want me to, we will continue Jurassic, whichever ones we don't finish, which probably... I might not, it, it's questionable, but if you've enjoyed this video, guys, and have enjoyed San Diego, well, Jurassic Park San Diego, I'd appreciate the like, and if you haven't already, do hit the subscribe button to join the hunt, and if you have any ideas for videos you want me to do, like tips or tricks, because I want to do a bunch of those, do leave suggestions in the comments on things you'd like me to do for you guys, like if there's a tip on, like, how to make the best aviary or something, let me know. And until next time, guys, with the grandest music, I'll see you later.